Hi, my name's Sam. I'm a business owner. I used to use Microsoft Excel and recently switched to Apple Numbers. And for more reviews like this, click the link below. So in my job, I need a spreadsheet to manage all sorts of forms. At the moment, I'm coding surveys and using it to write code in the cells and produce these questionnaires. Um, so both of them can do that. And that's why I need it. Numbers is great, and I chose it because it's free. It's uh, built into all my Mac devices, and it works well with the Apple ecosystem. Excel, once you've paid the subscription, has a lot more features than Numbers. And having made the shift, I do miss some of those features, and it's taken me a while to find workarounds. Uh, it's got a lot more options for editing and coding and equations, the numbers and formatting. It's also more familiar having grown up in the Microsoft ecosystem and it's more ubiquitous across the workplace. So I'm often having to translate my numbers files into Excel files before sharing them, which is frustrating. If you've used spreadsheet software before, you'll find both of these easy. Uh, it takes a little tweaking if you're jumping between one and the other. And if you're brand new to spreadsheets, um, it's quite a gentle landing. It's just a, a table with rows and columns. And I think it's easy to then upskill yourself and grow more uh, competent in the advanced features. When looking for this type of spreadsheet software, I think the top consideration has to be what ecosystem are you in? If you are a heavy Microsoft user using their other products, I'd go with Excel. If you are not, then Numbers is a viable option. Uh, I think cost is a second consideration. If you want to save money, go with the free Numbers native software. Uh, if you want to spend a bit of money, then Excel is, is more capable as a piece of software.